Hi guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to be reviewing a mod I received from a, a company called Signature Mods. Uh, this is the unit. It's their Dual SX mod. Uh, let's dive down and have a look a little bit closer. Okay, so here we have the box. Uh, this is what the Dual SX Mini, Dual SX comes in. Sorry. Um, when we open it up, you've got a nice plaque here which says Dual SX by Signature Mods. As I said, the company is known as signature tips um, but this obviously then bringing out a mod they've renamed it signature mod so you've got a lovely engraving just here you've got a serial number this is number 19 and then you've got the unit inside there's actually this spongy stuff here just to protect it while it's in transit um, and that's what you get in the box there is no manual as this is running the SX uh, 350J chip so you know user manual be online um, this is really for experienced vapors I'd say anyway um, you know a lot of features in it it does have temperature control and as, as, as I said it is a dual battery mod so just move that to the side so here is the actual unit uh, yes I have branded it it won't come like that it'll just come with their little logo in the side corner there um, on the side here, you've got in um, you've got grooves along the side here where your fingers are actually meant to, you know, sit there nicely, comfortably, uh, just to hold the unit so you don't drop it or anything like that. You've got a 510 connector at the top. I think that's a Big Daddy connector. It's uh, spring loaded in there. Uh, nice little vent holes all the way across. I do notice that on a few mods that they don't actually go all the way across. Not that 80s really need them now, uh, but some still do. So on the side here, you've got your fire button, your screen. If I just press that, you just see the screen come up. Yeah, it's got no atomizer on there at the moment. And you've got your positive, your negative, and your port for um, updates. Um, I don't think you can charge through it as yet, but you know batteries are easy to pop out of this and put them in a proper charger, so no worries there. Um, this is a solid aluminium block, you know, it's all being handcrafted by themselves. This isn't somebody else's um, box that they've just used, they've actually done this themselves. They've, um, you know, designed this from top to bottom. All themselves. This, as I said, it is a UK-based company. They've produced produced this over here. They've manufactured it over here. Uh, one of the things that really get me excited about this unit is the fact that you know anything happens to this unit, I can send it back. It doesn't have to go overseas to be repaired. Um, so you know that's a great plus to me because if I did drop it, I would be very upset about it. So that's the actual lid part. So where the actual logo is is the lid. So if we just pop that off, now this is held on with four magnets and they are very strong, you know, there's no worry about it coming off or anything like that, this has been produced very well. What you do have on it are four magnets, one in each corner, as I said, very strong. You've got grooves out here just to make space for the battery and the circuit board. Just move that away and here we have the insides. Now I am running some Samsung batteries in here at the moment, but I'm not sure if you can actually see that, but they've put a plate in there obviously to protect the wires, and they've actually engraved it with their logo there. Um, a lot of mods are plastic, um, and as I said, this is a really well done, well built mod. So here we have the chip, which is the 350J chip, as I said, by SX, or Yeehe, sorry and then you obviously your batteries and I think these are in series um, so this is going to be running 120 watts so double the power as the, as the SX um, M class and just to give you a warning it do, the 510 connector does look off to the side slightly but when we do put the casing back on you know it lines up perfectly there's no problems there whatsoever um, also on the front you've got your serial number or sorry your yeah serial number to match your box so you know these are all customized hand built and I can't stress that enough so let's just have a quick look around the box now I did ask the manufacturers about venting holes for the battery um, but we, after we spoke to them or I spoke to them I did find out that the screen is recessed in this gap quite a bit so any vapor or any fumes would come out around the screen or 
well, around the screen really uh, so I'm not really worried about that aspect of it so that's the unit there uh, I'm very impressed I mean I've had it since Thursday so I've had a good play on it really I've had it all weekend I took it to the Modball Rally which was in London this weekend uh, showing it off as much as I could um, I had loads of people coming up to me and asking me about it so let's take it back up to the top and I'll show you how it vapes and we'll have another little chat about it so we're back up top now um, you know we've had a quick look at it uh, this review is just you know a brief look at it um, give you an example of the quality of work from signature tips um, I've gone really well with them at the moment you know any questions that I have had I've you know they've responded very quickly very friendly um, you need to head over to their site to have a look at the other bits they do I know they do uh, drip tips for tanks they do replacement tanks for uh, the below V2 for instance they've got um, you know tank stands and stuff like that and everything's handcrafted from them really nice stuff I'll put a link in the below for you so you can have a look at now this unit is a hundred and eighty nine ninety nine now that sounds like a lot of money but I mean the SX um, M class is I think 170 180 pounds roughly you know and if that did go wrong then you know who would you take it back to who would you send it back to you've only got a certain amount of warranty on it at least this way you know they offer a full service um, ser service service on this product so you know you could send it back to them they'd replace cases for you they'd replace uh, anything they had needed you know some sort of, there may be a charge involved there but at least you know you can get it repaired and it had come back to you in perfect working order so that's the chair that's the uh, mod sorry uh, I have just stuck a uh, dripper on here an RDA uh, at the moment I've got the infinity CLT version 2 I think it is so that's there I'm um, not going to go too much into the actual chip of it um, uh, you know it is exactly the same as the SXM class it is their chip at the end of the day literally it's the box that's been manufactured and the way it's been wired has been by signature tips so let's just have a quick vape on it okay so you know it tastes great obviously that's a lot down to the RDA on it but power wise there's plenty of power there for you um, you know temperature control on it works very well it works exactly the same way but the main thing about this unit is it is a custom high-end unit um, and I'd quite gladly pay that money to know that I've got a mod for life to say now obviously other chips are going to be coming out you know they're going to be getting more advanced but the best thing about signature tips is obviously they will put the new chips in their um, their boxes so you know they'll always be up to date with everything obviously they're going to change the, the way it looks some may be um, you know I've just really enjoyed it I know uh, I think is it um, Twisted 420 will be uh, getting one for review as well so that'd be interesting to see how he um, gets on with the unit I have had people say that it is a bit too big but you know those people are using the smaller mods really um, I've quite enjoyed it I've got quite a big hand so you know it sits nicely in my palm anyway um, you know and battery life brilliant you know it lasts me um, I think a day and a half to two days roughly depending on how I'm actually vaping this uh, you know just from the box the, the unit you know if that's if their reputation's any sort of thing to go on um, like the design or the quality of their build you know I'd be happy dealing with them at any point really so hopefully they'll be bringing out some new stuff as well uh, I don't think there's anything in the pipeline yet but you know they may surprise us so you know great mod thank you signature tips for sending this to me um, it's been great to actually have it in my hand you know review it test it um, they've listened to feedback that I've had to give them or given them another thing you know you, you know you get that rattling sound from some some mods where the buttons rattle and stuff like that nothing absolutely solid I am very chuffed with this unit have been looking forward to it since I saw it was going to be released or it was in the uh, process of getting produced um, so again thank you very much thank you for watching hope to see you again uh, nice short video and I think we're done see you later